Yo, what's up my fellow skill stacker? Yes, I'm calling you a skill stacker because that is what I'm hoping you will join me in becoming. When I first started my career, I had two skills. And when I say career, I mean career as a creative. I started my own business and got away from my nine to five. Yes, without any kind of backup, without any kind of stability, I went and started my own business because I had no other choice. And so in this video, I wanna share some mindset stuff, but I wanna share something practical with you that will change your life forever if you can actually implement this because information plus the application of that information is what's gonna get you the transformation that you want. So like I said at the very beginning of this, I only had two skills when I first started my career. Those were graphic design and retail sales. I had done cell phone sales, I had done home loan sales, I had done some car sales. If you can sell, you should never be out of a job. You will always be employed if you know how to sell. So I wanna show you the difference. When I first started doing graphic design and I was selling graphic design, I was making 10, 12, maybe $15 an hour at best on a good day. But it wasn't until I started stacking other skills and adding to my graphic design skills where my income and ultimately my life started to change. So let me just read off a couple of these skills that I think that you might need to learn or you should learn and you might already know some of these. So this could be an encouragement for you if you already know some of these skills. All right, the skills I had when I first started, graphic design and retail sales and prospecting. Now the skills I have over the last 15 years of my career. B2B sales, which is business to business sales. Branding graphic design, web design, Google advertising, search engine optimization or search engine marketing, video production and editing, YouTube video marketing, video marketing or marketing strategy and planning, marketing agency operations, so building and running a marketing agency, leadership development, public speaking, book writing, content creation, business coaching and consulting, sales funnel building, and automation, radio show and podcast production, printing production and brokering, sign installation and vehicle wraps, LinkedIn lead generation, which is a big one, and event production and live streaming. Now, those are 21 different skills that I've stacked on top of my original skills that have taken me from making $10 an hour to over $1,000 an hour. And I'm wondering if you can guess by dropping a link down in the comments, what do you think of all of those skills makes me the most amount of money. Is it branding? Do you think it's graphic design? Is it video editing? Maybe it's marketing. Maybe that's your guess. I wanna know, drop a comment down below. Let me know what it is that you think is the number one highest paying skill that I have that has gotten me to where I am today. The answer is actually really straightforward and really simple, consulting. Coaching and consulting and helping other people solve their biggest problems in life and business is where I've been able to have the greatest reward. So helping other people solve their biggest challenges in life and business is when I, where I've been able to get paid the most amount of money. It's not public speaking, it's not in graphic design, it's not in branding, it's not in marketing, it's helping other people. Notice a pattern there. So when you start helping other people, you, got, you start getting paid in proportion to the size of the problems that you're solving. When I first started, I was only able to help them by doing a business card design because they needed to get the word out about their new business. Now I help companies come up with six figure, seven figure and eight figure marketing plans that help them scale their businesses from a million, million and a half, two million to 10, 20 and $35 million a year. The bigger the problem you solve, the higher you get paid. So I want you to start thinking like a skill stacker and stop thinking like a graphic designer or just a typical business owner because there's a lot of skills that you're gonna to need to stack. And there's many skills that I didn't even list in there like inside of your finances. There are five core pillars inside of every business. Finance, operations, sales, marketing, and fulfillment. These are the five pillars of every business. If you don't understand these, if you don't know the ins and outs of each of these, this is an area where you need to go inside and start stacking more skills. There are books that you can read, like I have here on my shelf to my left, where you can read all these different books, Traction, Good to Great, The Four Hour Work Week, Entree Leadership. These are all ways that I've been able to stack my skills. Watching YouTube videos are ways that I've been able to stack my skills and going out and applying the information that I'm learning. I want you to apply the information that you're learning from my videos. I want you to watch more of, my, more of my videos. And as I start to create more content, more courses, more stuff that you can get your hands on and actually start implementing into your business, 
you're going to start to see your life transformed. So if you're watching this video and you're struggling financially and you're broke and you're not where you wanna be, it's because you don't have the skill set yet that you need to be able to get to where you want. So you need to set a target, you need to set an objective, and once you've set that objective, you can start to acquire the skills through YouTube, through coaches, through consultants, through mentors, through books, through all the different methods, courses and programs, and you can start to really level up your life and level up your business, and that's gonna make a dramatic impact on you like it did for me. So that's what I got for you guys today. I hope you can become a skill stacker like me. Drop a comment down below, introduce yourself, and make sure you check out the Instagraphics Pro Network on Facebook. We're actually gonna be taking it off of Facebook here real soon and inviting everybody in for free. So if you wanna take advantage of that, hit the link back down in the description. Make sure you fill out all the questions because I, I refuse over 60%. I turn down 60% of the people that try to come into the group. So if you don't hit all the questions right and fill them all out, I won't let you in. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys hope to see you guys in the group. And until next time, I'm Adrian Boysell. And as always, keep looking up.